<laughs> hey, Sandra Mitchell, you got here before I even got on. It's five o'clock in the morning. I'm just getting in. I knock on the door. A voice sweet and low says, who is it? She opened up the door and let me in, let me in. And never once did she say, where have you been? She said, are you hungry? Are you hungry, honey? Did you eat yet? Let me hang up your coat. It's five o'clock in the morning. And I don't give it a second thought. It's a thin line between love and hate. She gonna fool you one day. Now here's the, here's the message. The sweetest woman in the world can be the meanest woman in the world if you make her that way. Boo, boo, boom, boo, boom. You keep her. And deep inside, she's lightly holding something inside that will really, really hurt you one day. Here you are laying in the in the bank, <laughs> bandaged from feet to head. Ooh. Let me see. Didn't think the woman would do something like this to me. Didn't think the girl had the nerve. Here I am. I guess action speaks louder than words. It's a thin line. I don't know why that song comes to heart. Hey, people. How y'all doing? Y'all rather have my bad singing or, or these long uh, introductions people's using, honey? These long in, uh, musical introductions. Anyway, how y'all doing? Hi, Marcel Mitchell. You got in before I even started. Allegedly, Shell Whitfield. Mm -hmm. Hi, Shakira. LA Five Bliss. Mm -hmm. Getting into it, right? Okay. Uh, hi, Tore. Tore in New York City. How y'all doing? Good afternoon. Getting into it. It's a thin line, baby. Mm mm. Now, this, okay, y'all know officially I don't like doxing. I'm not a doxer. You know, I have to sit around worrying about Timothy Blaine doxing you for shit, right? Y'all know the first book I wrote, let me take an opportunity to, to plug, to shamelessly plug. First, about this sector is called, no, it's Deadly Wager. Wait a minute. Mm -mm. I did, okay, here it is. This first book was called Murder in the Beef Sector, available at Amazon right now. Murder in the Beef Sector. This is a book about uh, a doxer who eventually doxed a lunatic, right? They doxed the wrong person. They were regularly doxing, right? Deadly Wager was about people uh, betting on who could do the, the worst things to people on YouTube to go viral, right? The book I'm currently writing on is called Who Shot the Caller? I've had this thing about doxing and calling and all that. But, so officially I don't like doxing. But a strange occurrence happened on today where yesterday, uh, Five Babe uh, threatened to call the employment of Jay Wilson. Right now, we all know, I think I'm the one that, that that first confronted him that he was pretending to go to work in the morning, but I can't tell nobody and all this shit. And I knew he was he was driving for Uber. Right. So now he's making videos entitled uh, driving for Uber on my way to my Uber. I'm only going to. The so she's going on and on about Uber, Uber, Uber. Right. And just <laughs> there's a word they use in the church called discernment. Right. Discernment. That means you should be able to know people, to discern certain things about people, right? You over here said you don't care, I don't care, and then she, uh, this, this mess, mess has happened to him. So he thought she wouldn't call these people 
on his Uber job, right? And so we definitely have confirmation that all the employment he has is driving Uber. All the talk about I'm a chaplain, I'm a this, I'm a that. You were never nothing but a damn temporary girl. You don't even have the hours to qualify as a chaplain, right? Because you can't get it together because you can't keep a job, right? Now we're talking about a person in their mid 50s. He say 52, my guess is 55. Yes, these ears are still out. Anyway, I guess, uh, I think it was a couple of weeks ago, he kept coming on here, act like he had his mysterious job. I'm going to work. I'm going, yeah, you went to work as an Uber driver, girl, a cab driver, driving people around, right? So uh, she said she was going to dox his employment and also uh, the SPCA for the care of his dog. This is to aggravate him more, right? Uh, just like Jay Wilson did not believe when he was over there fucking with that uh, ZX, he didn't believe those people would call call where he worked at, right? And he had all these people calling and calling and calling until a decision was made, right? That, no, 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 no. You can't be over here and be a temporary. And you have all this drama coming to a house. This is sick people here, right? And so we have to let you go like that, right? He come on. Oh, it don't bother me. Oh, I don't care. I got I got opportunities. I got plenty of nigga. If you had opportunities, you would have used them by now, Jay Wilson. You wouldn't be out here driving a cab. I could drive the damn Uber cab. I could sign up for Uber and be driving tomorrow, girl. Anyway, he didn't believe her. So she came on today and she uh, attempted to call Uber just like when you call uh, YouTube. There is no phone number for YouTube. You got to go through email process. This is what they told her. She wrote an extensive letter about him about him to his employer, which is only income he has is Uber aside from YouTube, right? Although he would not allow you, he would not let you believe that. He said, oh, I don't care. I don't need his money. I don't need it. She trying to use today as an opportunity to beg. As a matter of fact. Uh, let me see. There, he made that stupid ass uh, uh, video. Like he don't. Oh, it don't bother me. Oh, I guess they gonna take my job. I'm about to lose my car. Who be at the door now? They they they're gonna take the dog. Oh, they are gonna take my. You know, being stupid, right? But I can feel the burn, and I know that he feels the burn, right? Nobody wants nobody in their personal business, which I've tried to express to this fool over and over and over again, right? He said, "Oh, oh, they gonna take your social security. They gonna take." I'm saying anybody. Nobody has a right to be in your personal business, period, girl, period. Right? You all up in people's bedrooms. You all up in their goddamn finances. You all up in the, I don't know, the care and feeding of their animals, girl. You all up in everything, right? And you thought that woman was going to call. Well, she sent these letters to Uber. Here's where the fool made a mistake. He's going to claim when Uber contacts him, that he does not make YouTube videos with people in the car, right? But he's so stupid that on yesterday, that this man, mm -hmm. on yesterday, he made a video call. Can you see the title? He's in the car on the way to pick up somebody at the airport, right? I have to read it for you. You can't see it. Ubering today. So now you have actually involved their company, right? And you go on and you're talking about Uber this and Uber that, and you mix it in the end with all your evil madness, right? So he's going to claim to Uber when they contact him, oh, I never I never uh, make videos when somebody's in the car. I never make it. But you are using their name. You're attaching their name to this filthy, nasty bullshit that you do on here, right? Where you're actually accusing people of being whores and sluts and all this kind of shit, right? And the thing that kills me, and I, when, I, when I mentioned uh, uh, discernment, Jay Wilson, why do you believe that you're going to be able to do a, a, Five Babe has showed you over and over again, what she is capable of. You've seen it, right? You've seen it over and over again where she's been in it with certain people and they have doxxed each other and all that kind of shit. She threatened to dox me and you've been able to see it. Why would you go sticking that bear? It is so stupid, Jay Wilson. So I'm gonna tell you something. 
even if Uber doesn't give a fuck about one e email, addresses and phone numbers are being dropped. You have made the video. She she attached the video with you going on and on about you, Uber, the experience of Uber mixed in with your doc. You're, you're talking shit about all these goddamn people, right? What happens, Jay Wilson, if people start calling Uber like they called the hospital? I mean, use your brain, honey. And when you come over here acting like you don't care, you don't care, that only aggra aggravates your, uh, your uh, adversary more because they've already told you that next I'm going for this or next I'm going for that. As a matter of fact, it's the way I remember it, Jay Wilson. The reason why those people called the hospital, because you told them to. You dared them to. You don't care, right? And they had to sit there and make you care and make you understand that, no, this is not just a show. It's a show. It's not real life. It's not my real. It is, is real life, nigga. Aren't you a real person? Aren't you a real person spewing all this bullshit? You have made 20-something videos about that situation with, with uh, Sacramento. And then you keep on and on and on and on. And now you think you're going to box with Miss Five Baby and them, and they've already told you, girl, what they're going to do to you, right? And now you, you, they're, they're in action. So since you're saying that that doesn't bother you, let me see what else I can do to bother you, right? I know where you live. I know your address. I know many things about you because you can't stop running your goddamn mouth, right? I'm just saying, you look bothered to me. All this, oh, anybody want to help out? I lost my job. I lost my job. I'm going to lose my house. Trying to act like it's a joke, right? But really, you really want another opportunity to beg because anybody who's on YouTube for four and five day, times every single day, girl, they are desperate people. Uber don't pay you like that, baby. You talking about you go to Uber and, uh, and you get bigger tips. Nigga, you living on tips? You a waitress? You're trying to maintain a house, an unwanted, an unneeded household on tips. And that's what you call about on here is the tips, right? And the reason why, because Tracy seems confused, she don't understand why uh, you hate Five Babe so much. It all comes down to money. It's always been about money. You hate her because she has cultivated an audience which is constantly giving her money. Some, it, 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 at the height of her career in YouTube, she people were giving her five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars a night, and that not only did that bother you, it drove you nuts because all of your scams, girl, were not paying you anything, right? And like this bullshit today, let's check and see what it brought to the end today. Here's his last message. I want to thank all for giving to the crying for coins campaign. Y'all did that in capital letters. Y'all did that. We did what, nigga? Y'all did that. I would mention the amount, but the haters, uh, the haters, you know, LOL. You ain't nobody giving you shit, this thing. Ain't nobody giving you shit. And when they do give you shit, you need every goddamn dime to try to maintain this, this, this lifestyle that you can't afford, girl. You can't afford that on no goddamn uh, driving Uber cabs, getting tips or up early, four o'clock in the morning, girl, driving people around this thing. I mean, YouTube is your lifeline, honey. And then it is disgusting to watch you because all the people I watch, breakfast club, entertainment people, uh, beef sector people, black sector people, I have never encountered a person who is on YouTube four and five times a day, two and three hours each, right? This is an average of 12 to 16 hours a day you are on YouTube, particularly lately. And as we can see, all these mystery jobs you had that, oh, I got options. I got, op what the fuck are the options, girl? When did they kick in? You 55 years old, bitch. When did the options kick in, nigga? What options? McDonald's? You can't be honest about nothing. And so when I saw you going into that mall with the little clip-on tie and the little kid shirt on there, you're probably going to Baby Gap. So goddamn, you were going there to apply, either apply for a job or do a job that you were already doing part-time. 
it has been confirmed that you, even at your best, you just work for temporary agencies. Anybody can go down there and sign up for a temporary agency. We need a boxing clerk today. Wh whatever. I doubt that they need a chaplain. And then you're not even a qualified chaplain, girl. And there's nothing in chaplain, chaplain seat, chaplain me about you. Nothing. Girl, I'd rather have the devil praying over me than Jay Wilson. You silly ass queen. I'm surprised you don't come back here and tell, oh, 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 pray, pray for your granddaddy. Isn't, isn't it the song you were singing? Pray for your granddaddy. Were well, you supposed to be the chaplain in the, in the hospital, girl? That's why they immediately discarded you, Jay Wilson. And if those people who follow Five Babe decide to join in on the fun, if they start continually calling to complain on about you, it will draw the attention. I don't give a goddamn who you are. I'm a good driver. I'm a good girl. If you don't have Rex, you're a good driver. What the fuck is that? What do you 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 sing for the people in the car? It's a ridiculous person. How y'all doing? How y'all y'all been following the story? So five babe docks Jay Wilson at Uber and Lyft and the uh the animal shelter. This happened today. He immediately comes on. Oh, she got me, girl. She got me. She got me, girl. I don't sound just like when they when they got you off of that chaplaincy thing where you could not even complete the hours necessary to become a chaplain, right? I would say that's pretty significant. If those people start calling these places, Jay Wilson, you'll find your ass. Uh, I don't know if you even get unemployment. I don't know what the hell you're doing, girl. But I know it's all piecemeal. Right. So I want you to acknowledge that when I identify, when you said you're going to work, I identified he's nothing but driving Uber. I think I was the first girl. He's driving Uber again. I, I was correct. It was very obvious to me, girl. Now, when I spoke about your discernment, I'm talking about. You know what five babe is capable of. You have seen her in action, right? Why would you go in there talking about that woman is sending some man in prison uh, her friend's boyfriend in, in jail and sending him money. Why would you just say that? And then you say, oh, 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 I read it somewhere. Oh, I, I'm not a journalist. I'm not a journalist. So you think you can just come over here and slander people because they don't have, they're not going to invest the time or money to sue your black ass girl. And you, you say, I, I just want to say it. Somebody said it. Some, I can't say who said it. Somebody said, it. girl, there are millions of people on YouTube. You mean to tell me that all they have to do is say something and you're going to come and report it as fact. Right? So my guess is the woman is not through with you, Jay Wilson. You keep saying it, how it don't hurt, don't hurt. It may be time for another one of them vacations of yours. Remember the one where you ran away and lost, uh, what was it, 60 pounds in two, in three weeks, girl? You might have to take another, another one of those sabbaticals, girl. To let things cool off a little bit. Right? Your options are few. Options are few. You try to pray, but where are you? You all churched out, hurt and abused. <laughs> you don't know. Mm -mm. Uh oh, baby, what goes around comes around. You put her down. Now you're the clown. She had her eyes on you for three long years. When no one else wanted you, she gave you content. And let you talk with her. But then you drifted away. Jay Wilson, don't be so obvious, girl. Don't be so obviously desperate. All these horrible, nasty things you say about people. and you get, you, Because you feel like you have to say it, right? Because you need YouTube like nobody else on YouTube, girl. Ain't nobody going it like that, Jay Wilson. Nobody. And you continually telling us that you have options because you got degrees. You got, I got a degree. I, the church has already rejected you, Jay Wilson. What, what, what is it going to take for you to understand, girl? You're not even a church. You're not even a decent church queen. You're not, girl. Ain't nothing religious about you. You, girl, you rem you memorized a few passages. You could have done that without going to seminary, girl. Right. Uh, uh, everything you say you you are uh, you have a degree in, girl. None of it has any significance at all. It was all a waste of time. The only thing you got out of that were those student loans, which you never paid back. That's it. It is shameful. 
driving around. Ew. Getting a, who the hell wants to get up at four thirty in the morning, girl? Driving motherfuckers around, going to pick up their food. Here you go, sir. Here you go, sir. Oh, thank you, sir. May I have some more? Working for tips. The doctor. How y'all doing today? How are y'all doing on today, baby? Mm -mm. Yeah, she really did it, honey. She did it, and she threatens to go more, honey. That boy is just packed. She's going to find out how, how far he, behind he is on that mortgage, too. You see? That's your, you lack discernment, girl. You don't know who to fuck with, right? That's why you keep finding your ass in a sticky wicket. But in your mind, you feel like, they're talking about me. They're talking about me. Let me go make four or five videos about it. Everything is, let me go make another video about it. Ooh, ooh, give to the fun. Sound like, sound like a, a DKL over there, girl. Thank you. Oh, for all you gave. For all you show us what they gave, girl. Nobody gave you shit, Jay Wilson. If you gave you any damn thing, you wouldn't have to be on here five times. Two hours each. Mm -hmm. Do y'all believe that boy felt the sting today? I think anybody feels the sting when somebody goes fucking in their real life, girl. If you were behind on your PGE and you it's all over YouTube, girl, you think that doesn't bother you? Of course it bothers you. Wherever you work, girls might call in your goddamn job. Why would you want people to draw interest on you? And then you're dumb enough to make a video with the company name in the damn video, girl, and going on talking about how you going to, to uh you're on your Uber run and you're gonna pick them up, they're gonna give a bigger tip and all this shit, mix it in the end with all this tacky ass, catty ass shit that you do on there, girl, you're accusing people of, uh, of fucking their other people's boyfriends and just any goddamn thing that comes into your head, girl, to try to stay on here and try to stay relevant. But you wanna be relevant on the beef sector, girl? Is that really relevant for a doctor? You, you claim the name doctor, right? You say you have a doctorate, therefore you are a doctor. As I told you before, you need to take the name doctor off of there because you look foolish. You look like a goddamn fool, right? J Jay Wilson is not a doctor. You claim that James Wilcox has a doctorate, right? They have the option if they want to add it to their name. I would suggest that you use that in your professional life, which is non-existent. And, but then as Jay Wilson, the, the fool on here, you're neither doctor nor pastor. You're neither one, girl. You're a figment of your own imagination. Mm -hmm. You think I look handsome today, Shell with you? No, thank you. Oh, I got another haircut. I, I, I'm wondering if you get old, do your hair grow faster? I used to go once a month. Now it's like every two weeks I got to cut my hair. Even though I barely got any. It's a thin line, baby. He got himself into that mess. That whole thing when all them hundreds of people were calling that hospital. He told them to call. He dared them to call. They called. And he's out of the job. It didn't bother me. It didn't bother me. Why, why wouldn't it bother you? What, what are you mentally ill? Right? How many more careers is there going to be, Jay Wilson? You're 55 years old, bitch. How many new starts are you going to have, girl? You found something online that, oh, you can be a chaplain. You could be a chaplain. Here's the training. We saw you in the training, girl. That wasn't about a few hours a week, girl. Then you try to go and you made up that humongous lie that they, you had gotten this job coming right out of the school and they had paid you all this money and you were making $160,000 a year and you couldn't be bothered with beef no more. And then you came to people, what they going to do without YouTube? What they going to do without YouTube? Yet you're the most hungry on here, girl. You're hungry than anybody. You're more hungry than people on welfare more desperate, right? You've thrown self-esteem, self-respect right out the window. You don't, the, the way you turn on your 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 faithful supporter, Treasy, it is disgusting. I don't know why you think that's funny. There's no humor in it, girl. It is disgusting. You are a pig. Mm -hmm. What y'all think? What do y'all think about the situation? It seems like every day there's a different situation on YouTube. One story blends into another one, right? We are iced here in Dallas. Is it that cold? Angie? Angie Dickerson? That's another thing about this internet. Uh, everybody's in a different state, different city. One place is sunny. The other place is, is freezing. The other place is snowing. <laughs> 
Mm. Let me see. Thank you, Kanitha Russell. <laughs> she said, I look nice today. Did you put on a new shirt? <laughs> what do men do? They don't do nothing. Take a bath. Oh, they can put on these little cheap shirts. Okay. California, we very casual here, honey. You go to a uh, church in a jeans and a t-shirt. It's a very casual state. <laughs> Speaking of desperation, uh, Tanya said, Tanya says, Wiley talked about you again. <laughs> He really trying to drag me out there so he can get into the beef sector. He so you can't be in the beef sector without a beef, right? If he gonna come back, he got to have a beef. So he gonna keep on poking on me till I suck him upside his head, knock that eye straight. <laughs> Why do you think he want it? But he don't. Not really, honey. Not really. There's too much there, Whitey. You worried about HIV, nigga, and you sitting up here bipolar, girl. They got pills for the HIV, but but uh, those pills for bipolar are forever, honey. You leave a week, you out there, you out there tearing up libraries once again, girl. But uh, we gonna try to uh, our best to ignore Wiley. Thank you, Sarah. I'm your favorite relative. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. It makes me feel nice. Oh, I did start writing again. Uh, who shot the caller? Ironically, the caller, honey. <laughs> the caller on YouTube is about the beef sector still. It's the last book in the series. I was worried because I thought, well, if I try to write again, I got to go back to the whole goddamn thing. Remember every character, what they've done leading up to where I was at. But no, it was, I just sat down and picked it up right where it was. Uh, and got my two pages in, that's, that's very good. I usually get one or less. <laughs> Elaine says that 5A got it wrong. Jay Wilson doesn't earn his money from, oh, yes he does. Yes, he just came on and made a whole video about it. We saw him 4.30 in the morning going to the airport, Elaine. He's a consultant and got his own website. What does that mean, girl? I got a website. I ain't even checked on it, girl, in three years. <laughs> that ain't nothing, child. <laughs> a consultant. Who going to take advice from Jay Wilson? Lord have mercy. What are your successes, sir? Oh, uh, I, I got, I, I'm on YouTube. <laughs> Nigga, you might as well be a pop bottle bandit. Mm. Consulting business. Uh, Elaine, your assignment. Okay, here it is right here. If I if I click on this, will I go off of you guys? Hold on a minute. Let me copy this website. Hold on. Wait a minute. So, Elaine, if I click on this, am I going to lose you guys? How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Uh... Because it won't let me copy and paste from here. Oh, yes, it will. Okay, we'll copy. We'll copy. And we'll go. We're not doxing. We're going to his website. And then uh, I want to save you guys. So I'll go over here. And I'll click on the site that uh, Elaine said this is consulting business. Maybe you got to have a customer to have a cup have a company. Okay. And then I'll go and enter. Return. Is that it? Enter. Wait a minute. It says this site can't be reached. I might have did it wrong though. Uh I copied it, right? Okay. Let me go over here. I'll put it in. Search engine, paste, and jameswilcox.com. No, I'm sorry, baby. Elaine, I tried. 
It says that website cannot be reached. I tried it three times. I don't know. Uh, the website can't be reached. You have a thriving business, but your website is down and it's based on a website. Everybody had a website. 12 year old children got a website. That ain't nothing. We see him driving, Elaine. Uh, Angie, he may drive Uber, but it's not his bread. It is his bread and butter. His bread and butter is YouTube, honey. How are you going to sit down and make five videos a day, girl, for the last th three weeks consistently? But basically, he's been doing that since he's been on here. When he gets a temporary assignment, he'll go away for a week or two, and a week, four days, whatever the hell they give him. And they come right back, girl. This is his primary income is YouTube, right? He's not mad enough to accept, accept that or to admit that. But this website is... How can you have a business and you can't even contact it? Where are the customers at? Elaine, check and see if you have the uh, the, the the site right. Studio YouTube.com live stream. Oh, no, that's not it. Wait a minute. Uh, Studio YouTube live stream. No, I, I copied the wrong thing there. Let's see. Let me delete that. Okay, now I'm gonna copy it again. Make sure I got it right. Copy. Uh, save you guys. Go to the uh, search engine and paste. It says uh, www.drjameswilcox.com. <laughs> this site can't be reached. Check if there's a typo. So Elaine, unless there's a typo, why are you believing in him today? You always opposed to the Jay Wilson. Uh-uh. Don't believe that hype, girl. It's called people tell you they got a website. A lot of people tell you they got a website. That is nothing. That is nothing if the website is not, not profitable. Many times you'll see that the website is, is no longer working because they didn't even have the $25 or $50 to maintain it, girl. Or nobody was coming to it, right? How you gonna have a website, girl? And you you on here every day, five times a day, three hours each video, and you ain't never mentioned it. Aren't you? Are you running a business? Shouldn't you be running people to your business since you on here twelve hours a day? Mm -hmm. mm -mm. Elaine, I think you're being facetious. You know that boy ain't shit. He ain't he, and he, and he feeling like shit. <laughs> He just might break something tonight. He said that uh, when he was trying to be facetious and, and thinks he'd be funny, baby, please stop. Hey, get the bum over here. This way. See that bum right there. Get the bum. Booty, booty, booty. <clears throat> Tim Uber ain't going to care about him being a YouTube because he's an independent contractor. <laughs> She's being facetious. She got to be. She is not no lover of Jay Wilson. <laughs> Girl, he's using their name in video from yesterday. She was smart enough to use something current, right? He used the one, this is messy, sad, hoish at the same time, where he talks all this shit, accuses people of being whores and all this stuff. All of it, everybody, everybody panties and everybody draws, right? But the most important thing is, Calling uh, 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 the uh, this Uber, I'm Ubering today. So he finally confessed. You have to catch Jay Wilson and everything. When I identified that he was back driving from Uber, now he says he's been driving for Uber for four years. He said it several times, right? He never stopped driving for Uber, right? But the thing is, you're using our company name, right? People don't want their name attached to, to bullshit, Jay Wilson. Can y'all see this stuff? Uh, I don't think you can. Anyway, Ubering today. Let's see what it says. That this man is really interested in five mm eight, -hmm. and I think th this guy is absolutely a dysfunctional genius. A dysfunctional genius. Girl, are you, you, him, and Jay Wilson are all dysfunctional geniuses, girl. They accept a lot of 
lot of people in the LGBTQIA. I'm just an Uber driver. Get ready to pick people up from the airport. Mm-hmm. That's all. Mm-hmm. I'm he a, always I'm likes to make it like it's a joke, driver. right? Yet you're up so, at four thirty every morning driving from your yeah. car to the airport. It appears to be that's the time the Uber has this this damn rate that he's talking about. I so, baby, I don't care where you work. You don't want nobody calling your job and saying shit about your personal life, right? If you get people when they're calling like they called that hospital, the people fired him just like that. Same same day he called. They didn't even call the supervisor to fire him. Why? Because he didn't really work there, girl. If you lied about that, he said he's making $160,000. We caught him red-handed. He moves on. He ain't never said a goddamn thing about the fact that he came on here lying. Why are you lying to us, Wilson? You told us you're making $45,000 from Uber and $160,000 from this job. You said you got hired at $130,000 while you were still at the school. They came and recruited you. They have recruiters to look for Jay Wilson to find a fucking, uh, 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 what do you call it? Uh, whatever. He's a, what the word? Whatever. I can't, I can't believe my brain. I don't remember the goddamn word. Whatever. He lied about all that, made him, made him all these stories, girl. He, he he lied when he said he was going to work when Tracy called his ass, girl. Why is he lying and lying and lying? And now y'all want to believe that now he wants to tell the truth. Nothing is true with that fool. Nickel and dime hustler. It's terrible. You over here complaining about other people's incomes, girl, when all of their bills and their obligations are being taken care of, girl. You're the one up at 4.30 in the morning driving people around, this thing. It's you, right? Because you have such an overhead. You have to do it. People say, well, why would he make another video? He's already made four today. He has to do it. He has no other income. We don't know if if, uh, initially he was getting unemployment, right? From when they threw him off the goddamn uh, uh, last job. For some reason or other now, he's got to make five and six videos a day, every single day for two and three hours each. It's, it's It's not even complicated. It's not even complicated. If he got such a successful business, he wouldn't be up there driving people around or picking up their lunch. Mm-hmm. The, I think Elaine is being facetious. I don't, I don't believe it. I don't believe it, Elaine. You are on the Jay Wilson hate train just as much as I am, girl. If it affects your money, it is real life. Absolutely. I don't know why these people is crazy, child. Oh, it's not real life. This is not my real What? When do you have a real life, nigga? You on YouTube 12 hours a day. That is your real life. I'm real right now. I says real skin, girl. The fuck are you talking about? This is my real mouth talking. Maybe because you don't tell the truth about a goddamn thing. It's not real to you. Mm-hmm. Kanita Russell, check out the site. She can't check out the site, girl. Unless you made an error. Let me do this. I'm going to put in, without without be going to that site, which you can't reach that site, it's been, let me just go in here and put, uh, let's put uh, doctor. It's a joke. Do you have Dr. James Wilcox? James. Wilcox, let's say, uh, let's say Dr. James Wilcox, they, uh, he got Dr. James Wilcox Jr. So they should tell us if he has a business, right? I see picture, picture, picture. They're all about on YouTube, okay? Uh, videos. Daily Motion has a video of him. Wait a minute. Dr. James Wilcox, remarkably capable expert. Expert at what, nigga? Wait a minute. Then he got one called Dr. J. Wilcox, an assertive and competent professional. Then he got one called Dr. J. Wilcox. These are all with his picture of him now. Uh, a visionary, determined leader. Wait a minute. What the fuck? Hold on a minute. Oh, that's right. Whatever I play on here will not play for you guys. So y'all wait a minute. They're only 50-second videos. 
this video cannot be played in line. Go to Daily Motion. Well, you have to go to Daily Motion. <laughs> they even have uh, this video of him when he was at this church. Is your church a, a, a cult? When he had all them fucked up teeth in his mouth, <laughs> girl. <laughs> the nigga got a whole different mouth. Okay. Oh, they got all the pictures of all of these uh, choirs. So is he a consultant for the choir? James Wilcox, a remarkably capable expert. James Wilcox, 40 seconds. Visionary. Wait a minute. Uh, video has been removed. So each one time I click, okay. I'm not a doctor, so I ain't, I don't gotta go through all that shit. I know you just, I ain't jocks him. Baby, he's got a business. You can look up anybody. Mm-hmm. Girl, he got all the time. He's a he's a, <laughs> a website that can't be reached. And then we got he's over here advertising himself for 40 second videos. All right, that convinced me. Well, we'll leave all that up to the doctors, uh, Elaine. But thank you for the information. I know that I just doxed him, but you ain't doxed him, girl. That shit is public. If he got a business, can't we go into the store? If a store is a business, can't we walk into the store? Mm -hmm. He's worse than Andrew Caldwell, baby. Uh, Elaine, I doubt that whatever that shit is you put on, you put anything on you online, girl. Uh, I doubt that it makes a profit. You can't even reach the website. The website's down. And even when the other ones are, he's bragging, oh, he's, a, he's a, a genius. You can't even, uh, uh, you can't even reach the, the websites. So that's just another another uh, little small time hus hustle, child. I don't see where it makes any money. You have to judge them by their fruit, uh, Elaine. If a person's on here twelve hours a day, child, with the, the stupidest shit, throwing all his friends under the bus, girl, that tells you that that is a desperate person. He's desperate. He needs to be in a studio apartment somewhere. And maybe uh, Watts. Maybe you get a, a reasonable rate in Watts. <laughs> I don't know what the slum is called in San Antonio, right? But that's where he needs to be, somewhere he can afford. You know the children are going to get on top of that, Elaine. I knew there was something going on there. Mm hmm <laughs> He has a blog and everything. I stand. He has a blog and every oh girl. We got to go and do some research on that. So why aren't you advertising your blog? That's what everybody else does. Mm -hmm. So that tells us then if he has a blog and everything else and he has a website for I don't he consulted somebody on something on what? If he has all that girl. There's a reason why he's not bragging about it on YouTube since he brags about everything. That means he is vulnerable with that website, right? And so now uh, people can access this, the website. Lord, Lord. I said I don't dox. I don't believe in it, girl. He makes it so easy. But we'll see. We'll see what else, what else Miss Five Baby will do to him. But he started the fight. Mm-hmm. Making up stories about people. Why is she a whore? You said she's she's going behind Tracy's back to send her boyfriend. Who in the fuck wants Rob Rack? Girl, I think if she wants somebody's man, she set her sights a little higher than Rob Rack in a whole different state, girl. Starting up shit, trying to get them to fight each other. Tracy said he hates uh five babe. He hates five babe because five babe makes money. The thing he can't seem to do. Hi, Miss Tracy. I hope I didn't step on your feet too bad by going live. I only have a you know a few good hours, girl. <laughs> uh uh. We talk about the, your ex over here, child. Oh, misunderstood is here. Claudia, Valerie, how y'all doing? Mm -mm. Rico's here too. The gift that keeps on giving. To me, it's just it's just so stupid. 
Tim Elaine posted the link in the chat for you to see. I saw I went to the 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 the, the uh I went to the what she's posting on there to the link and it says that that video is not available. However, if you I just put a Dr. James Wilcox Jr. and it gave me the information about what they're calling a website. He got 40 second videos on there telling you how wonder how he's a stable genius and all that shit, girl. We have to look a little further into that. But for some reason, he's been hiding that information, which means he's vulnerable in that area if he's trying to do something else. So now they know, oh, he's got a website. Let's go over there and, sit, let's go over there and see it. <laughs> I'm not lying, people. Y'all want me to try it again? No, we'll leave out all that to the to the doctors, girl. I don't, I'm not a believer, remember. It's so easy to get drawn into it because then you want to know more and more and more and more. I ain't investigating that motherfucker. I know he's full of shit, and I know that his only income is from Uber and YouTube. Because somebody tells you they got a website, do not be impressed with that. Many times, many, many of these websites, they fail because the people don't even pay the dues because they got no traffic on them, child. None. People go in and find out, oh, you know, what's the what's the traffic on here, right? <laughs> Does anybody know about it? Why hasn't he said anything about it on YouTube, girl? Right? If his YouTube is a connection to the world, why would he not mention this website? And what the hell is he selling? He said he's a capable girl. Don't let me do it. No, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I can't be writing books about uh, killing off uh, callers if I'm doing the same thing. So I got to let it go. Mm -hmm. We ain't all like that, right, Tracy? <laughs> now he's live talking about Tracy's world. Girl, he's in everybody's shit. And he knows he's over there suffering. He is suffering. He does not want that woman going and bothering him or his job, honey. Jay Wilson can't keep a job, baby. I'm sorry. Tim, Tim, Tim. Click the link from the chat on your phone. Okay. Elaine says, click the link from the chat. Now how am I going to do this? Go to, go to my, okay. I'll go to my page and open it up. I'm doing what you said, Elaine. And now I see you got this. Uh, hold on. Now you got the link in here. You might got to put it up again. Ooh, this writing is so small. Okay. Just click the link. Where's the link at, girl? This thing only goes back so far. You got to put it in again, Elaine. Uh, I don't see the link there. I know I can only scroll back so far on my phone. It doesn't give you all of them. The chat to the website. Where is it at? Thank you, Lucky Jazz, for Cash App Super Chat. She said she posted it in the link. I don't see it. Have y'all seen it? Have, okay, here it is. This is going to be fun. What's going on? No, this is not Dotson. Okay, it's got a big old picture of that ball head. <laughs> Dr. James Wilcox Jr. You see him? He has a smile on that ball head. Unmistakable. Let's see what it says. Career coach. Girl, how in the fuck are you a career coach, nigga? You ain't got no career. Tommy, you ain't got no career. Y'all see it? It says, y'all can do the same thing. Click on her uh, link. It says, business description, career coach, Dr. James... Wait a minute. Dr. Wilcox Jr. 
is a native of Cocoa, Florida. He was also the director of student success. Student success from a man who can't keep a job. He is a career coach from a man who's driving Uber for a living and making YouTube videos, okay? Success for National American University. Girl, she got other pictures. This is at Mark House. You see the hats? That means that's Mark's house. Lord have mercy. Okay, Elaine, we see. Oh, now I see what you was, I know it's something funny. Oh my God, they got their boy's address in here. Cibolo, Texas. I ain't telling no addresses. Girl, they even got a map. To, ooh, he got all this information on here, dumb dumb. Leave a review. Nobody is bothered to leave a review. Okay. Submit. That's it. Leave a review. A review of what? They have another link in here. Let me click on that. It says the same thing. How you a business consultant, nigga? You ain't got nothing on the website. All they got is a picture of him. A picture of him saying he's a he's a business. His business is he's a career coach. They got a picture of him at, at Mark's house. And that's it. A map to where you can find his ass. And that's it. That's the website. Girl, you don't get the fuck out of here. How what are you saying, Jay? What do you want to review for? Leave a review. Submit. Submit what? You didn't say nothing. Okay, so I, I'm with the. I'm. I'm. I'm thinking, this is bullshit here. You want? We want you. Share. We want you. Share feedback. Is my computer dirty? What the hell is going on? But I can't see nothing, girl. Okay, let's click on that. We want you clear. Okay. I clicked on it. Where is it at? All it says is leave a review. Uh, a re as to what the review is, what are you reviewing? There's nothing on the website. All right, Lane. We're going to give you points. For you, are, you are right. He has a website. There's absolutely nothing on it other than him claiming to be a career coach, even though he is the least successful uh a doctor, pastor, chaplain, I don't know, car washer in American history. Tim doesn't have StreamYard. Y'all think I should get StreamYard again? I didn't like it that much before. I don't, I'm not with all the hollering and screaming. I, can't, uh, I think there's a way you get it for free. But even if you don't, it's only $25. Uh, yeah. I got rid of StreamYard. Okay, I'm going to make y'all a, a commitment now. By tomorrow, I'm going to sign up for StreamYard again. Uh, if I can find out how to do it for free, I will. But even if I can't, I'll go ahead and sacrifice and get StreamYard. But I won't be coming on here with all that, all those people and all this hollering. But if I want to talk to somebody, at least I'll be able to, to, to drop a link. Okay, that's the promise. StreamYard is too unorganized. I don't remember why. I remember I signed up for it and I paid them, for, I think, for four months or something, three months, and I never used it. I think I, I went live maybe three times. Uh, I'm not really into the thing with all those different people in it. Tim, you can use it for free for so many hours a month. Okay, Deanna Irving, I have to look into it. I think they may even still have my information on there because they're always asking me, do I want to sign up? We'll see. I'll check into it. If they, if I can't get it like that, then I'll just pay for it. Whatever. If somebody cash app you uh, $25 a month, it pays for it. So I guess you can't do it. Be, be selective about who hits your link. Yeah, that's what we'll do. I'm not going to have just open StreamYard for, you know, 10 people. Uh, we'll just, if I want to talk to somebody, I'll, I'll do that. Unc, you have uh, to click the three horizontal line at the bottom of his picture to read more. <laughs> Y'all trying to turn me out as a doctor. Because even if it's public information, when you share it, you become a doctor. Let me see. 
Okay, I got to get back to where I was. Let's see. I'm curious. What was his name? Dr. Pastor. <laughs> All titles, girl, and no meat. Where is the beef? Mm -mm. I can't find this shit again, girl. I don't want to hold y'all up while I look for stuff because it takes me a while sometimes. Uh, no, I'm on, still on YouTube, though. We'll do it. I'll do it later. Oh, y'all do it. <laughs> I ain't seen where uh, that fool has got a goddamn thing on some website talking about he's a career consultant. Jay Wilson, all the information, all the, the reads about you on YouTube or about your lack of ability to have a career, to develop a career, you're going to take some young mind and bend, bend it to make them believe that you are something that you are not. I don't want nobody giving me career advice unless they can have a career themselves, not a made up things, some shit you, you put together, girl. Uh uh. How of all things on the planet, Jay Wilson, are you a career consultant? You can get a viable job with five degrees. Now, if, you, if ever I heard of an a unsuccessful person, girl, you would think that would be the last thing that you would be doing. The very last. There's the link. Okay, that, that's the same link I clicked on the name. Well, I did find it. You just put his name in there. You'll find it. But there's nothing on it, so I can see. He's still bragging about having a house. <laughs> I got a hail. I got a hail. <laughs> the, day, the day he slipping and said that that car, that the stinking Lincoln is $625 a month, right? And he also said, well, of course, it's, it's all lies, so you, you got to pick through it. He also said that uh, that Uber made him get a, a, a newer car, just like I guessed at before, that because they don't want no stinking Lincoln or no raggedy-ass cars driving people around with their name on it, right? You have to have a, 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 a newish car to drive Uber, right? So he went out and bought the stinking Lincoln. But that's $650 a month. How much is gas? Another $400? Lately, it seems like. Anyway... So all this money he paid it for for this damn car, then he had lost it with Uber because he thought that he was a chaplain because he had he was he working for a temporary agency and they assigned him somewhere for something like three to four weeks. He was assigned somewhere. They could go out and buy a brand new car. He also suggested that the, the Uber has somehow or other that car is attached to Uber, right? I don't know if they own cars. I've heard that if you want to drive Uber. And you don't have an up-to-date vehicle, they will provide an up-to-date vehicle for you. You got to pay for it, of course. But uh, all this slipped out of the mouth. So you got to go picking through, mixing it up, and all this kind of shit, girl. Because this nigga can't tell the truth about nothing. Living your life in a fool's paradise. Mm -mm. A damn shame. <clears throat> And he in the news every day. That is not a mistake, people. It is intentional. It is intentional. Career consultant. Lord have mercy. <laughs> Boy, you do better just be a choir director. You could pretend you're doing something, girl. <laughs> what the hell? She had a fat ass up there. She, go, ooh, she shook her booty, girl. <laughs> I could just smell it. Oh, disgusting. So all of that is on the website as well, this choir stuff, girl. I don't know what kind of a career consulting you're doing, Jane Wilson. Are you going to tell them, go to school, go to school. I got these degrees. Girl, if I work for that college he came out of, it's only I think there's only one real school. If I work for that, I would say, listen, we're very glad that you have a YouTube channel. But could you stop, please stop attaching our name to your career? Could you just stop saying our name, really? Because it makes people feel like, why should I go and get an education if this is what I'm going to end up being? Right? It makes the school look bad, Jay Wilson. You make the school look bad. 
This is probably why they fired you. Wasn't the last time you were fired? No, not the last time. You'd have had four jobs since then. But when they fired you and you said you were the dean of an online school, I don't know how that works exactly. You're the dean, but you're online. You're, you're whatever. Girl. When they fired you, you said they just laid you off, right? Well, uh, when are we going to get some, some callback tees? Damn, it's been three years. Are people laid off three, four years, girl? Career consultant. Girl, that just tickles me. That just tickles the shit out of me, Jay Wills. So you're sure you won't uh, fight, babe, digging in that ass? We done set up here on YouTube. I knew you were up to something, Elaine. <laughs> excuse me. Excuse me. That's just the salt and sugar. <laughs> but you worked that, honey. Uh, uh baby. She said, oh, no, I didn't, I didn't put it out. Oh, yes, you did, girl. <laughs> You really want people to start digging in that ass, Jay Wilson? Are you going to have to be a, a, a YouTube tragedy girl? Yeah, he make the school look bad. Don't you? Uh, hell no. Accredited. Is it accredited? Is it accredited? Now, meanwhile, you got plumbers making $300 an hour. Stupid ass. Thank you, LaSparkle Covington. That damn haircut. I got to go to another person. This dude raised, every time I go in there, he raises the damn rate. I think I'll start off paying him. I've been there for about five years. No longer than that. I've been here for 10 years. I started off paying him uh, $10 uh, for a haircut. You know, black people, it ain't all that. I don't get no fade, nothing. Just zip, zip, zip. He's through in five minutes, right? Uh, now the dude is is eighteen dollars and eighteen dollars for a haircut. It didn't double. I mean, I know everything is going up, but goddamn, you raise the rate every month. One dollar, two dollar, three dollar, four dollar. Shit. Oh, uh, baby, you got to tip them something, so that's twenty dollars. So a ten dollar haircut that became a twenty dollar haircut. Uh, uh. I don't like that feeling of being played. I don't like it. <clears throat> We got to find somebody else. Matter of fact, there's, there's a new one right here in front of my building. <laughs> we want something else digging in his ass, girl. <laughs> I don't know why he going over there kicking on Miss Five Eight. You know what she's going to do? She already told you. She ain't ashamed of it, you know. When he bring his ass over here fucking with me, he said, well... I know Timothy Bain ain't going to dox me at least, but you don't know that about everybody, girl. Tracy even knows how to put in work if necessary. <laughs> when necessary. When there's no other way to get you off my back, I know how to do it, baby. You so money hungry and desperate. And then Jay Wilson, don't be over there, you know, cheating people. You over here presenting yourself as a career consultant. I mean, come on, man. You of all people, Jay Wilson. Have you ever had a job more than a year? You said you worked at Delta for eight years. This was in your 20s, girl. You're now in your 50s. You have to go back to a job that you worked on 30-something years ago. And then, you know, how long were you actually there? Because you came on saying you worked there for eight years. A few months later, it was nine years. And I believe at some point, it's 12 years you worked there. I said, well, God damn. You can't remember if you worked there eight years or 12 years. Just lying. He ain't never had a career. Girl, the Better Business Bureau going to get you, Jay Wilson, all this false advertising. And what are you going to lead people into exactly? What are you going to teach them? What are you going to show them? Go and get a bunch of useless ass careers, uh, useless ass uh, degrees, girl, that don't mean nothing. You be educated. You be educated. Spell supercalifragilisticexpialidocious. Is that what your education for? I can spell it. I can spell it. But that's about it, though. <laughs> Just like his five-year relationship. Girl. Any time to, uh, to pop the question? We fought hard for gay marriage, girl. You say you got a partner. You in this perfect relationship, girl. Why don't you pop the question, right? And I, I would like to, you to, since we are so concerned with other people's alcoholism 
and how worthless they are, what worthless piece of shit they are because they drink. Bring Mark on, and then we can have a discussion. Maybe that could be my first uh, my first live stream. You and you and I and Mark can discuss discuss alcoholism, what that looks like. So desperate ass. Nigga ain't never had a boyfriend till he was 50 years old. I got a boyfriend. I got no, excuse me. I got a partner. I got a where's your partner? You ain't got no partner. Or we gonna go to Disneyland. Always going to amusement park. Grown ass. I'll be suspicious of a grown ass people who always hanging around amusement parks. Now we know there's only so much you could probably do in San Antonio. But girl, is that all you have to offer? Is that what is that like the big date? Because you go to Six Flags. Where do you get on the rides still? Wee! 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 Grown ass man. <clears throat> uh uh. Honey, I'd be very suspicious if my people want to hang around with kids all the time. It ain't got none. Mm -hmm. Oh, Faith, what happened? Why you, Tracy? Why you ignore Faith? Mm hmm. She said, I always want a little acknowledgement. He learned same gender loving from me. He learned about same gender loving. Same gender loving. I guess he thinks he's pro black when he says same gender loving because, oh, a black person made it up. I like the way it sounds. A black person said, Miss Thing. When you're talking about same gender loving, you're talking about love. The thing you're doing uh, on Grinder, what love got to do with it? Yes, you can say that if I'm in love, I'm in love with the same gender, right? There are applications where that would be totally appropriate to use, right? When you're in committed relationships, right? But gay is what you are. Some reason or other, you have a problem saying that you're gay. You're gay. Gay is your attraction. You're attracted to men, right? It ain't got nothing to do with love. Going into these, these dark places that you go to, you know, where you're pushing your booty up to the glory hole and letting strangers dig all up it, that ain't love, girl. What love got to do with it? Oh, a black man's hit. This thing, that sounds so stupid, right? When we fight for gay rights, girl, uh, is that just for the blacks? You're a gay. We have something in common. We have something in common if they're gay and Chinese. We have something in common, just that part of us. And then we have something in common with black people. So we are both. But you have to come to the conclusion that you're just gay, girl. Ain't nothing special about you, Jay Wilson. Nothing at all. If you want to claim that boy to be your husband, nigga, move him into your house and share a household with your alcoholic, girl. Right? You always like to take on titles. I'm in a committed relationship. I'm in, committed to what, girl? The man works a job. What are you committed to? Oh, booze call. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Booze calling. Wait a minute. Boo girl, you sound like a little 16-year-old girl, right? He called, mama. He called. Just foolish. Foolishness. Mm-hmm. They marry but living. Li they marry but living separately. <laughs> Girl, marking that stupid. I don't know if that boy is dumb or not, child. Uh, it takes a certain kind of person to call something like Jay Wilson the, your partner. Although we haven't heard Mark say that that was his partner, right? Mark, you might think that he, that's my friend across the street or whatever. You know, we don't know what he really feels about this thing. How does it feel to be claimed by you? Mm -hmm. Like a rolling stone. Mark might be having trade other people, child, as far as we know. The girl threatened to, to contact his wife, his ex-wife, or Mark's wife. That makes that boy very nervous, girl, because he don't want nobody to know the truth about nothing. Jay Wilson, you have wasted your life. You have wasted your life with all of this bullshit. When I look back over my life, there are many, many high points, girl. And, not, and a whole lot of low points. But this thing, it was a life lived. It was a life lived. It wasn't sitting up here pretending all this bullshit, girl. Right? 
Oh, oh, you went to a drug. You did. I wouldn't tell no drug. I would just think maybe you missed out on something then, bitch. Right? Because I made decisions based on what I wanted. I never even thought about what some bald headed black bitch in, in, in Texas, girl, thinks about my choices or my life, girl. Why do you, who makes you think you can make the decisions for people? And now you're over here talking about you a goddamn a career consultant. What are you going to consult the people, girl? They want to be successful. People have families, nigga. They have time. You're going to waste their time on, on a bunch of worthless ass information? Getting a bunch of degrees don't mean nothing, obviously. It means nothing, girl. You're supposed to be a singer. You can't go in your garage and record a one goddamn record. Oh, I'm going to go get the money. I just want the money. Oh, they're going to pay me $250. They're going to pay. So we'll see. We'll see how this all works out, right? Yes, it is a goddamn shame that this boy is in the news every day. It is not by accident. This is what he chooses. This is how he chooses to live his life, right? And he constantly got to tell you how this is not real life. He ain't got no friends. He all the same old boring. You are a boring person, Jay Wilson. You just, I'm just sorry. Somebody needs to tell you. You are an extremely boring person, girl, right? This is real life. What you're doing is real life, nigga. When I go and take a dump, girl, that's real life. I'm taking a real dump. Shit is actually falling out of my asshole, girl, right? Whatever I do is real life, Miss Thing. If I'm talking on the phone, that's real life. I'm talking to somebody. They are, they're in real life. I'm in real life. If I come on camera, that's my real life. Why? Because I tell the truth. It's always the real thing, right? You get confused because you're always lying about every goddamn thing and creating fantasies, girl, right? How in the fuck are you going to have a goddamn website telling you a career counselor? We have to pray for the young people that no one falls into your trap. Mm -hmm. Steve Urkel, you wondering who's Zooming who? Mm -hmm. Jay Wilson can't Zoom nobody. If Jay Wilson want to Zoom somebody, he have to use either a mop handle or a dildo or some inanimate object, maybe a lamp. He can't, he can't fuck nobody because he does not have a dick. He's a dickless wonder. He is ashamed at his age. Nobody comes out talking about, uh, 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 I'm, a, I'm a bisexual. I'm a top. Why you say you're a top? Who cares about that, girl? I, I All the gay out of experience in my life, I have never heard nobody come out talking about they're a top. Why? Because you're so ashamed of being a bottom, girl. It's so obvious, Jay Wilson. You're not easy to, you're not hard to read, girl. You're ashamed that you're giving up that stink thing. Ooh, girl, that thing, that thing, that thing. Girl, you know you better watch out. Call some of the marks are all about that thing, that thing. Don't matter what that shit, girl. You went and tried to take the tonnage off of it. And what you found out is you got nothing but flabby skin, girl. And when that boy sees that goddamn thing, it's like, oh, girl, I can't do this. I mean, I can't do this, man. This is no better than you being fat. You're disgusting. You have, you have to work to get it down to stretch marks. Stretch marks is a process, right? Because that's as far as it's going to go. But right now, it's just flabby skin. And when Tracy described when she was in her uh, mad at him, moment at that hotel she described that guy uh rob rack his body because he had had massive weight loss what it looked like how the titties were just hanging and all that she was mad. i don't know if she's still mad at him or what but what she described she was describing jay wilson because they did the exact same thing they they lost virtually the same amount of weight right so when she described what rob rack's uh body looked like she was describing what Jay Wilson's body looks like. That's why he, I'm going to the gym. I'm going to the gym, Miss Thing. And like I said, Miss Thing, I hope people are paying attention. Every time that bitch come on here, girl, she's eating. You're eating and eating and eating because you have, what you call it, an eating disorder, right? Which some psychiatrist has given you this diagnosis because you can't stop eating. And when you first came back, you weren't eating, right? And then you start eating. Oh, I'm having yogurt. I'm having non-fat yogurt. Non-fat yogurt. Oh, I have these chips are non-sugar. No sugar in the chips. No salt. Under 
He's just on, on, on. And then he's just eating all the time. He's always eating. So let's see how long that lasts. Mm -hmm. I can't believe this never gets old. That's right. We eat that bitch for the rest of my life. <laughs> They put it on my tombstone. Here is a man that read the shit out of Jay Wilson. <laughs> baby, baby, I hear you. All right, people. Thank y'all for coming in. Thank y'all for coming in. I'm glad you got a laugh there, uh, Faith and Claudia. Mm -hmm. We'll see how this ends up, child. He want to keep on. See, he has no discernment. A pastor. A pastor and a chaplain with no discernment, you don't realize that you back that girl into a corner, she's gonna come out rock'em sock'em robots. And she's not the only one, Jay Wilson. People are getting sick of you. And since you like to be in the in the in the in the airwave so much, girl, and you can just say anything, do anything to you, girl, then they, they'll say, Man, but let's push this a little bit more. Let's start investigating this website. And what the hell is that all about? Y'all have a wonderful Thursday. Mm-hmm. The damn squeeny. Dong, dong, dong. The ding, dong. The ding. Where you at? Deedy, bong, deedy, in the ding. Dong. Say goodbye to the people. Get your bum over here. Come on. Come on, squeeny. Get your bum up here. Okay. Say your hello. Hello. Hi, people. What you doing there? Why are you holding up my dad D? Time to go to dinner. How you doing, people? Look at that tongue. You see that tongue sniggering out? What's going on? Say hi. Hi, squeeny. <laughs> love my baby. Y'all don't understand dog love. Think about when a when uh, as a real baby, right? Now a baby can't talk. All they say is yang, yang. <laughs> right. But you love that baby like it was your right arm, honey, right? Even though they can't walk, they can't talk, all they do is poop, right? Just that little face. <laughs> Mama. That's how we feel about our dogs. They're babies forever. Mm -hmm. You understand dog, totally understand the dog love. All he got to do is sit there and look at you. Mm -hmm. He wants something to eat. <laughs> Shut up. You're ding dong dong. Be quiet, baby. All right, guys, I'm out of here. Uh-huh. Well, we're going to drift into the dog love now, baby. <laughs> Later. <laughs>